everyone and welcome to or back to my channel today I'm back with a summer vlog I thought it'd be fun to vlog a couple days of my life today I'm just gonna be having a productive day getting a few things on my list checked off running some errands getting my nails done my sister is coming into town and then we're gonna be doing some fun stuff this weekend her fiance is also coming into town I thought I'd vlog a couple summer days of my life I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog definitely give it a big thumbs up if you do and if you'd like to see more vlogs on my channel definitely make sure to subscribe if you're not subscribed turn on the notification bell follow me on instagram and tiktok at emilygrace.26 comment below your favorite thing to do in the summer or just like some fun things on your summer bucket list let's just get into the vlog first up i have a couple errands i need to run this morning i have some things i need to drop off at the post office and fedex i'm also gonna get a coffee treat myself to coffee later today i'm getting my nails and lashes done They're looking a little sparse right now so i'm excited to get them done i have a bunch of random things on my to-do list I'm just gonna try to get those checked off before my sister gets in town Let's go. Could I have a large iced vanilla latte? I got my coffee. Now I'm at FedEx. I'm just going to drop off one of my returns. just dropped off the last couple packages. The last errand I need to run is actually washing my car. I'm just gonna take it through the car wash. I haven't washed my car in a while and it's now like the end of winter. I think I'm gonna grab some lunch. Don't really have a lot of groceries and I know we're probably gonna be like eating out and stuff this weekend. We're all gonna be like together. <laughs> I thought I'd try something new today, kind of. I love the beach club sandwich from Jimmy John's. It's so good, literally the best thing ever. I usually get it on sliced wheat, which is so good, but I kind of wanted to try it just like on the regular, like what it comes with, like the French bread or whatever. <laughs> It is a little bit later. I'm actually just cleaning up my apartment. I think my mom and my sister are gonna stop by. I don't know if they're actually gonna come in my apartment, but it's kind of messy. I'm just gonna like pick it up just in case they decide to come in. My apartment is mostly picked up. It is almost time for my nail appointment. I think I'm gonna do something like this for my nails, just like really clean and neutral. I've had bright pink nails for the last couple weeks. I think I'm gonna do Bunny Bunny, the color from OPI. I was deciding between that or bright orange French tips, but I did bright colored French tips this time. And I'm gonna get my lashes filled. I'm excited to have fluffy lashes again because they're just looking a little bit sparse. I feel like today has gone by so fast. Like I with this color i'm so obsessed with my nails i think this color is so cute funny bunny from opi with the sheer pink kind of on top i also got my lashes filled so they're looking nice and full and fluffy like i said my sister is in town so i think i'm just gonna go have dinner with my family it's a couple days later we're actually gonna go to the farmer's market today and go to a few places the weather is beautiful today hopefully we'll get some breakfast or lunch or something because i am so hungry I think it's gonna be a super fun day Walking around the farmer's market, got some coffee. I think they're trying some mangoes. There's like a really long line, so it must be pretty good. I just went and took an Instagram picture. It's a mango flower. Wow. I'm gonna taste the mango. It's a little tart. Salt, lime, and chili. 10. 10? What would you rank yours out of 10? It is a little later. We are leaving the farmer's market. Now we are headed to lunch. We're going to this place I've never been to before. It is a big room with a bunch of different restaurants. So you have pizza, sushi, hamburgers, breakfast, a little bit of everything. And apparently it's like popular. I ordered a sandwich. Everybody ordered something different. 
it is the next day. We're about to head downtown. We're gonna grab some lunch. We're also gonna do some shopping. I've been really wanting to get my third piercing. I thought it'd be really fun for my sister and I to get matching piercings, like for her to get her second and I'm gonna get my third. There's actually this really cute piercing place that I've seen on TikTok. It's actually right by the restaurant we're gonna be at. I think we're gonna go and get matching piercings. It's gonna be a super fun day. This coffee is so good. Our lunch was so good. We are on our way to get our ears pierced. Are you excited, Lauren? Yes, I'm nervous. I haven't had anything pierced since I was like four. I'm excited on the website. It looks like they had a lot of cute earring options. It literally just felt like a little, like, like a poke. We're doing some shopping. We got our piercings. Lauren got a little, little stud, and I got these. Well, also like a little stud. It's like a little Trinity stud. And over here is Lauren's big stud. Later, I just got some super cute bracelets at Kendra Scott. I just went in there with my mom and I found these really cute bracelets. I love this little chain, gold chain bracelet. I've been looking for one like this. It's been like a very jewelry type day. I just wanted to pop on here and say thank you so much to Squarespace for sponsoring today's video. I recently created my own website and I'm so obsessed with it. I just wanted to share it with you guys because Squarespace has been so helpful, especially if you're a content creator or if you own your own business. It's so easy to set up your website and there's so many great business tools. It's so nice to have everything all in one place as well. That's one of my favorite things about Squarespace. If you haven't heard of Squarespace, if you're not familiar with it, it is an all-in-one platform for growing your brand and building your business online. You can engage with your audience and you can sell anything from your time, your content, and of course your products. You can create and host a website that really fits your style, your aesthetic, your personality. They have so many different templates, so it's so easy to set up and customize and really just make it look how you want. They have different colors and fonts. It's so fun to go on there and customize it and move things around. Like I said, I just made my own Squarespace website and I'm absolutely loving how it turned out. I kind of use it to showcase my content as a content creator. It's so nice to have everything all in one place. They have so many great business tools. If you're a business owner, Squarespace is definitely a must have because they really do have everything you need. You can sell your products online directly through your Squarespace website. Whether you sell physical or digital products, Squarespace has all the tools you need to start selling online. If you sell in person, you can connect a Square Reader to the Squarespace app and keep your orders, inventory, customer data, all in sync with your online store. Something else that is super helpful is that you can upload, organize, and access all your content from one place. With the new asset library, you're able to manage all your files from one place and use them across the Squarespace platform. I'm personally not very good at organizing all of my files. I absolutely love this feature. Another feature that I love as a content creator specifically is all of the blogging tools. You can break your posts into categories, you can share them, and you can also schedule them. It really just helps to keep all of your content organized. I've been absolutely loving Squarespace. I think it's so amazing. I definitely recommend, especially as a business owner, content creator, it is so, so helpful, especially just to have everything all in one place and just have one website where everything is there, your contact information, your content. And I actually do have a discount code. Go to squarespace.com for a free trial. And when you're ready to launch, go to squarespace.com slash emilygrace to save 10% off your first purchase of a website or domain. I'm gonna have that linked below at the very top of my description. It is the next day. I'm about to go take some Instagram pictures. I just got a whole package from White Fox. I'm gonna be doing a try on haul soon. It's gonna be up after this video, I think, like in a couple days. Really quickly, I just wanted to do a little haul slash unboxing of some stuff that I picked up recently. I picked up some really cute stuff over the last couple days, like shopping, and I've also ordered some stuff online, so I thought I would do a little haul. First up is Amazon. I ordered this little cowgirl hat, and my sister got a matching one. She saw a TikTok where these girls were like decorating them and putting like little beads, making little coastal cowgirl themed hats. We're just gonna like decorate them
them while she's here. Also got some seashell beads. I don't want to spill them. I'll link these below if you guys want to make some as well. And I'll probably show it in the vlog. I think we're going to make them tomorrow. I also got this bracelet. You probably can't see it because this lighting is crazy. It is from Kendra Scott. I got it yesterday while we were shopping. And then I also got another one that was like half chunky gold and then also like some little pearls. I thought this was really cute. I've been wanting a little chunky gold bracelet for a while. I'll also link this one below. This is super random, but I got some body wash from Trader Joe's. This is supposed to be like the Sol de Janeiro dupe. My sister picked it up for me. It smells so good. It literally smells like coconut and summer. I haven't used it yet, but it smells so good. I also ordered a couple things from Sephora. I've been waiting to open them. The thing that I'm most excited about is this Tower 28 lip gloss. Apparently it's like not sticky. I love the look of lip glosses, but I just hate when they're sticky. I'm really excited to try this and see if it's actually not sticky. So I got the shade Pistachio and this just looks so pretty. Like look at it. I've never tried any Tower 28 products. This is my first one, but I've heard amazing things about them i didn't have anything on my lips really before love this color i don't know it just seems like a normal lip gloss but we'll see we'll see if it seems sticky i think it looks really pretty i like it so far i also just picked up some more freck faux freckles pen I have one but i'm kind of running low i used some of my points for some glow recipe minis the little sample size of some glow recipe products so i got the glow recipe watermelon glow niacinamide dew drops and then the avocado ceramide recovery serum i don't think i've ever tried any products from them i don't think so i'm excited to try these i love anything with niacinamide lastly from sephora i got some beauty blender cleanser because if you guys know you know i just recently picked up my first beauty blender i tried to clean it and it was just not cleaning very well so i thought this might help with that let me know how you guys clean your beauty blenders because what i normally use to clean my makeup brushes which is baby shampoo was just not working maybe i don't really need this so let me know what you guys use last but not least adina eden said me a PR package. I absolutely love their jewelry. It's so pretty and so good and they actually just started selling their jewelry on Amazon. So I'll have it all linked below and also all on my Amazon storefront. I love their jewelry. I'm so excited. I actually didn't pick any of this out so I have no idea what they sent me. They sent me this cute little bag. This was inside the box. It was like a little cute bag. Like I feel like I just went to the store. Inside there's three little boxes. So I think they sent me three things. In this first one we have this necklace. Like a little herringbone chain. I love these types of necklaces. I think they're so cute and they're so pretty to layer in the second one super cute gold hoops they're like little gold huggies with like a little chain lastly let's see what's in the last box gold huggies like some little diamond kind of gold huggies those are so cute I will be wearing all of those and then once my piercing heels I can layer those up that is my little haul slash unboxing I picked up a bunch of random things lately so I've been wanting to like unbox them on the vlog now I'm gonna go take some Instagram pictures I'm taking a picture for white fox I have this little graphic tank and then like these baggy jeans taking up my usual spot if you know you know just like this little white wall so I'm gonna take this picture I changed into a different shirt. My fake tan like really needs redone. Just in case I didn't like the tank top. All my content for White Fox is due in a few days, so I just don't really have time to come back up and take more pictures. So I took some pictures in the tank top and the t-shirt. I got those pictures taken. That is pretty much all the pictures I'm taking for today. I'm here with Lauren. We're about to go get acai bowls. We actually went a couple days ago, but they were so good. We actually got free ones. So we're gonna go back and use our free ones. Are you gonna get the same thing you got last time? I might switch it up. We're gonna go there and then we're all so maybe gonna eat coffee as well. And what are we doing after that? Having coffee? After that. I don't know. Then we're gonna make these little coastal cowgirl hats. That'll be super fun. We got our acai bowls and now we're gonna get some coffee. I'm so excited. This place has really good coffee. starting our little cowgirl hat craft taking these hats that we ordered off of amazon i'll link them below and then a bunch of beads that i previously ordered off of amazon i got them a couple summers ago when i was making like phone terms these little seashell beads that i ordered off of amazon and then we're gonna make these little coastal cowgirl hats and i hope they turn out cute i think they will i think i kind of know what i'm gonna do with mine are you gonna go for a blue color scheme see like blue
here is the final product of our hats. I also have like a little pink strand. Lauren's is super cute. I totally forgot to film an outro for this vlog, but I just wanna say thank you so much for watching. I really hope you guys enjoyed. Definitely give it a big thumbs up if you did and comment below your favorite thing to do in the summertime, some things on your summer bucket list. Make sure to check out Squarespace. I'm gonna have it linked below at the very top of my description if you wanna check it out and launch your own website. I hope you guys are having a great week, a great day. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you in a couple days for my next video. Bye.